something that he's lacking that has his right arm too straight, and all of that is really getting into how fast the club face closes. And I would suspect if Graham's watching this, most of his bad shots aren't really bad, but he does hit a lot of pulls, maybe pull draws. I don't know about his driver, but I'd suspect the same type of thing, and maybe some heel hits from how straight his arm is. Sounds good. Sounds good? Yeah, okay. Sounds about right, yeah. Uh, now, another way that you can look at this, and with a touch more certainty, he doesn't quite have the hip sway needed to give himself the side bend. So as his hands appear above his shoulder, we'll do the same thing for Dustin Johnson. And in here, you can recognize a big difference in the amount of side bend from both his hips and his shoulders relative to Dustin in there. And that's generally from the front view that he doesn't have enough uh, hip sway towards the target, so his impact position is a little tilted to the right, but not enough. His lead leg is too straight, his right leg is too straight, and the way I would hit this ball at impact is to have my lead knee slightly ahead, close to an inch further toward the target than where the center of your ankle would be. That would be a good way to measure that from the front. We don't have the front view swing, but it shows up right here as a, that's the problem. At impact, that was lacking to make these pictures le much less tilted to the right. Think okay. we can show them how to do this a little better? Oh, yeah, okay. sure. All right, so let's go over here. Kevin, you quick on the draw? Oh, nice, okay. So from the front view, just demonstrate Graham's impact position. So less hip sway, his lead knee would look like yours, and he's got a ton of his weight pushing back into his heel. And none of this is wrong, but having your right arm as straight as uh, Graham does at impact, that is a little tougher one to overcome because as your arm is straightening, you're also starting to close the face more. If you want to have the face the most open to the target that you could, just keep bending your arm more and more and more and more and more and that's making it easier to open the face to the target. It slows down that, the rate that the face is closing relative to your swing direction. So, lead knee in front of your ankle, right about, put it right over my finger here. That would be a good place to recognize uh, how far you want to pull your hips towards the target to give yourself that relationship of knee to ankle. So you could start just by hitting little chip shots that way, posing up against the, push against your couch at night or something while you're uh, watching TV or whatever you're doing, watching 